He's rolling. That's probably a dark hole. Oh. What if you press? You press. There you go. The screen's regulating now. Hi! Hi. Welcome to Fun with Fromage with me, Ellen, and Phil. Yay! Um, this is um, a regular little thing that we do where we um, we taste test some of our favourite savoury selections of um, fantastic fromage. Yeah? So you normally just say fromage. welcome to fun with fromage. Welcome to fun with fromage. I don't think you need to explain it. I think fun with fromage is, is does what it says on the tin. Yeah, you're probably right. And okay. 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 Next. So, today, um, we've, we've been down the supermarket and... Uh, We've raided the It'll Rotten Tomorrow show. Yeah, and it would appear um, the apocalypse is coming and, yeah, everything's empty. But we found some some, some cheesy treats. So we thought we would... Um, Do you want to put the other light? No, 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 no. It's the end of the day, my makeup's worn off. Okay. Uh, lots of light is my enemy. So... What we have is a selection of three different uh, savouries. We have mac and cheese bites. No, no, no. These are mozzarella sticks. There's lots of these. Why do you get so many of them? Because they have loads left over. And these are chili cheese bites. Um, and a dippy tomato ketchup. What does the fox say? He says, nom nom nom, dippy cheese selection. Nom 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 nom. So. So does a fox have... have what does a fox say? That's how it goes. Does a it. fox have a cloaca? No, because he doesn't lay eggs, does he? He only lays dog eggs. <laughs> <laughs> no, he doesn't have a cloaca. You, you need to, if you don't know what we're on about here, you need to go back one episode. But no, um, he does not do a clo clo cloaca, ki cloaca kiss. Thank you, Sandra, for then, telling uh, me about that. Yeah. Um, not all, not everything that, that has a cloaca does a cloaca kiss. Well, what's the point of cloaca then? It's a multifunction, in out, in <coughs> out. Yeah, but, but some animals lay their eggs unfertilised and then the other one comes along and fertilises Right, I eggs. strongly suspect a fox does not have a cloaca. No, it's a fox is a mammal, it doesn't have a cloaca. Well, there you go then. I was just, I was, I was just a quick game of, of, of clacker or cloaca. You're obsessed with this idea of clacker or clo cloaca now, aren't you? And anyway, let's let's get back to the job in hand. So, um, what, 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 I'm going to go for first. Grab one. So these are the uh, mac and cheese bites. This one is a mac and cheese bite, which has been left in the warmer for a very long time. No, that's actually ace. And it's kind of desiccated. Oh, that's ace. Yeah. Yeah. That's, I mean, that's just literally mac and cheese. Yeah, that's very dark, isn't it? Look. Yeah, because we're back to it. All right, chill out. No difference at all. <laughs> Yeah, that's just mac and cheese, literally in batter, and it's a flipping brilliant. We give a little tomato. Bit low on the cheese, to be honest, because it's dried up. You dip it in the Tommy Zing Zang. That's well nice. Yeah. 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 I love this sort of thing, though. Clats. I love clats. I love them. Right. I'm in favour of them, but they're not brilliant. So these are mozzarella sticks. Well, I shouldn't have done that. Should I? You eat that bit. <laughs> I think you need, we need to be thinking about our coronavirus oh my God. protocols. Can you see how burnt that mozzarella is? How brown it is? Oh my God, yeah. Just, wow. That's more or less coal we're eating there, mate. But that's actually still quite nice. Actually, though, burnt cheese is a very fine thing. I love the taste of burnt cheese. You're absolutely right, though. We do need to think about our uh, coronavirus protocols for the night. You know, for our viewing public, you understand. 
the thing is though, mate, if I go down with this, your tote's going down with this as well, and vice versa, let's face it. Anyway, I'm going to try another one, see if that's just as burnt. Yeah, again, looks like a battered sausage. That's so burnt. Hmm? That is so burnt. Hmm. Anyway, after I... Ah, I've bit my cup. But they're all right. Yep. So, that's uh, my Ferrella stitch. Oh, I can't even break this one. Don't do it, your break tooth. Your break tooth. I cannot afford a trip to the dentist right now. You're on strike, mate. Right. Let's go for the uh, chilli cheese bites. Crunchier than your average cheese. Yeah, I'm not sure if your cheese should be crunchy, to be honest. Not like that, anyway. Oh. Oh. That's, that's got a bit of a kick. Not loads. It's it's sort of, I suspect it's cheese and potato and chilli. It's the least impressive of the three. I think the winner for me is the... Yeah, the winner is the macaroni cheese bites, mate. Don't I quite like that. That, that was all right. That, that, that definitely yeah. had cheese still to it. Now, don't get me wrong. If the mac and cheese bites were cooked properly and not been mm. warmed and gone out, they'd be the best. And these, um, well, that's not mozzarella anymore. That's um, coal. Montezuma or something. I don't know. Um, but the uh, as they actually stand, these are my these are the best ones, I think. And I'm not a big fan of. Well, you you can eat them then because I'm I'm not. Just... You think that's like Mexicana in there? Who knows? I think it's just chili and cheese. I think it's just cheese. It's probably cheese analogue, mate. Mm. But there we go. They weren't quality products, but um, each of them was 38p, so we can't really moan. Um, I'm not sure if this was really the funniest or most informative of our cheese videos, but, you know, Celebi, any, any final words? I suppose, given our uh, <coughs> coronavirus breakfast, you can always get an overcooked mozzarella stick to stick up your nose, stop your inhaling. I could only just make out some of what you, you were saying then. You, your mouth was so full. It's probably a good thing because it wasn't a very good taste. Oh, uh, okay. That's mine. I'm not, I'm, I wasn't one of the... She's not bothered about these, but she's having it. No, no, I like the mac and cheese ones. They're good. Anyway, we're on eight minutes, so... That's... Oh, I might turn it off. Yeah. Bye!